With this building, we usher in a new era of luxury, a new age of technology in which our quality of life will increase tenfold. Compliance test six initiated. Um, why is there twitchy toes? <laughs> Alright folks, it's DR Gibbs here. We're going to be playing a maze, the broken tower. This is the second game on, in the maze series. And of course this is made by Madhead Games. Beautiful Madhead Games. I'm already digging the the rain effect here in the uh, main menu. I'm playing this live. I'm playing this in front of all of the beautiful people at YouTube. The lovelies over at Hitbox and a little special feature today. We're doing this for some people over at Twitch. Thank you all for hanging out with me today. Uh, we're gonna have some fun with this and for all you folks that are watching this after the fact, you're missing it. We gotta get together on these live streams. You gotta come hang out with the gang. So anyways, we're going to get into this. We're going to hit that play button and find out what this one is all about. So we've got easy, medium, hard. I like how the G gets more like rusty and aged with the difficulty. Nice giant red check mark. It's been almost a year since the once sprawling and modern residential powerhouse, the Gehenna Tower, was shut down. With a series of disappearances related to the tower still unresolved, city officials have decided to tear it down. A team has been sent to do a final review of the building and prep it for demolition. Okay, let's bring this baby down. You're the best student I've ever had, so you get to start the final review of the building. <gasps> We're a student. AA for being a student. I love the G's everywhere. Oh, you're playing Cadenza 3, are you? I liked Cadenza 3. Actually, I liked all of the Cadenzas. Uh, I'm not sure why we're demolishing it. Maybe because of all the terrible things that happened a year ago? Underground lab, maybe because of that? I don't know. It's kind of sad that such an impressive structure has to be torn down. The graphics do look really nice. Look at the lens flare over here. Got some rain outside here and like droplets on the window. It is, but it's also the last thing standing between you and that promotion you've been after. Now let's put this notice up at the front desk so we can get to work. Yeah, Megan, I, I totally agree. It does definitely does have a Bioshock feel to it. Uh, we're gonna do special features only. No, I haven't streamed the, the second Beyond beta yet, no. Just Adam Wolf so far. The graphics do look amazing, so... Blackmail, uh-huh. All right, put me to work. I think it's neat, right? So Madhead, uh, this is clearly their new game engine. You can tell by the open menu, uh, but the user interface is different. Like just differently, it looks different than the last game we played. So it's kind of neat how they do that. Okay, let's see what this is. Cutting edge residential hub. Sarah. Hmm, sounds like a girl's name. Okay. The cutting edge residential hub you've been aching for. The Gehenna Tower equipped with highly advanced Sarah artificial intelligence system. Okay, that is definitely feeling like Resident Evil. And something must have gone terribly wrong with Sarah. That's sharp. What's a knife doing here? There's no need to call anyone. Fine, we won't call anyone then. Let's go and put our notice up. Uh, dragging. Ooh, look at me. I'm dragging. Dragging. Uh, 
Public notice. Here, we'll use this to communicate in case we get separated. Sure thing. Yeah, do you think we're gonna? There's gonna be some people inside of here when we knock this thing down. I don't know. Hopefully not. Now let's head up and get started. Oh, you haven't played the first Bioshock? Oh, you know what? I actually liked the second Bioshock better than the first. Uh, mostly because for the second Bioshock, they kind of figured out the controls a little bit better. But still, the story in the first Bioshock and the second one, really good. I actually even liked Bioshock Infinity, which was more like the one that takes place in the sky. That was a lot of fun as well. Yeah, when we get separated, exactly. Um, wait a minute, why is his... Okay, that was just my imagination. I thought I saw glitter on his, um, you know, pants there, but no, my imagination. It's not working. Ah, oh, great. You'd think a building this size would have more than one elevator. One elevator? Is that even legal? Someone sure had to grease a lot of palms to get this built. It was supposed to be a technological marvel. Probably was at the time. I'll try to find the controls so we can get the elevator working. Sounds good. We have to restore the power to the elevator. Hmm. Okay. I couldn't help it. It was all shiny. It wasn't my fault. Honest. Glitter pants. Yeah, exactly. Let's see here. We've got a folded piece of paper. Let's find out what's in here. It's the letter G. The key is in the roof. Janitor Joe. It's probably this thing, isn't it? There we go. We have found a key! Yay! Uh, sure. So this is a key. It is a bronze key. For our elevator, apparently. And we have a puzzle. Let's find out what we're supposed to be doing here. Toggle all the dots to white. To toggle dots, drag a line between two or more dots of the same color. Uh, we just there we go. And we're doing this again because we can. This is pretty cool. Oh wait, I think I messed it up, didn't I? Oops. Uh, sh gotta do two of them instead of three. There you go. And one more time for fun. Oh shoot, I screwed that up again too. I saw that yellow one there. Okay, so. How am I gonna do this? Uh, let's try this, and then we'll do that, uh, green can go there, yellow, and then red. We did it! Okay. Systems online. I am Sarah. Welcome to the Gehenna Tower. <gasps> Maybe we're playing Portal 4. Could be that as well. What do you think? All right, let's get this show on the road. We've got a whole skyscraper to inspect. Hop in. Uh, no, the Bioshock games are uh, not on Big Fish. They're more of a traditional video game. Yeah, it's Sarah without the age. I know, and she has a creepy voice. GLaDOS, yeah, that's who I was thinking about, actually. Hey! Testing initiated. What the... Uh-oh, we're 
being tested. Ted, are you okay? Ted, Ted, we're separated. I, I hit my head. I'm not sure what happened. The elevator just. Uh oh, are we gonna see a big daddy soon? <laughs> Maybe. No, I'm pretty sure you saw what you saw. I like how these uh, heads here have green glowy eyes now. That's great. There should be a phone somewhere nearby. I'll try calling for help. Oh, I just realized this is probably a collectible, isn't it? Haha. -ha. I think somebody mentioned that in the chat that there was a collectible on the, the logo. But anyways, here we go. Let's call 911. With a snap of our fingers. S snap. Nine. One. One. Nine. One. One. What's your emergency? The elevator. GLaDOS is back. I'm at the Gehenna Tower. There's been an accident. Totally. In case of emergency, all exits will be sealed and communications terminated. Oh boy. Well, congratulations, Crystal, on graduating next week. I really am glad you managed to survive. A C-3PO? No, 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 no. Oh, well, maybe a little bit. It has a kind of coppery look to him, sure. C-3PO is from Star Wars. Yes, okay. Uh, GLaDOS, where... What have you done? Why have you sealed and... Terminated things. What? Whoa, no. geez. What are you doing? Okay, that startled me. Please wait for Gehenna security personnel to handle the situation. Wait. Are, are the security folks like robots? Uh, I think we're in trouble. Ted, the building cut off all communications. There's no way out. What are we gonna do? Liz, there's someone in here. He's just standing in the hallway. What's creeping me out? Hello, Jesse. I'm a huge fan of you. Thank you for hanging out with us today. Yeah, uh-oh. We're in trouble. You've got to help me. The elevator isn't responding. Maybe you should try calling it. Please, just get me out of here. What are we gonna do next? Um, hmm. Go up? Is that gonna work? Let's try it. It looks like it's on the 50th floor. I don't like elevators that move that fast. That's insane. Oh, okay. We got blood. Oh no, there's blood. What are we gonna do? I don't wanna go in this elevator. There's blood in here. Uh. <laughs> Oops, I leaned on that statue and it fell over. Okay, catch up. There's something off of me. Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Calm down, Liz. Calm down, Gibbs. Calm down. No one is here. Not Ted. Not anyone. Scent of blood detected. Applying air freshener. Stand by. Oh, what? <laughs> What's with the crazy music? Elevator music. Nice. Smells like flowers. <laughs> Maybe that's music from Cadenza. I am gratified to hear you enjoy it, resident. Look at the spider over here. My goodness. Why does it say watching us over here? Uh, who's watching us? What's wrong with this place? I'll take that umbrella. 
What are you looking at? Ew, cobwebs. Welcome to Compliance Test 1. Please follow the instructions to comply. Oh my goodness. Are we going to have our own cube? What is that cube called in Portal? I want to call, I want to say friendship cube, but I don't think that's the right one. Oh, oh, I know what it is. How many people know what the cube's called in the Portal? What do you mean by compliance test? Uh-huh. Yes, that's right, the companion cube. Okay, this totally has a Bioshock feel here. Are we going to crawl in here? Please. Place your hand in the opening next to the screen. Ha! There's no way I'm doing that! But then I've... What? Uh... I hope... Yeah, I think you can post links, because you're a moderator. There's no way I'm placing my hand in this dark hole. I don't have time for this. I need to get to Ted. I should just do whatever it's asking. No, I... Oh, jeez. <laughs> Oh, it's gonna take DNA sample, guaranteed. Well done. Keep your hand there and press the green button to comply. No. Please comply by pressing the green button or you will be punished. Comply no. or die, resident. Compliance is required to survive <laughs> in the Gehenna province.